puppies all week and then you know you have one photo here of your food and then one down there, it's going to take you forever to make your progress report. But ultimately that's your responsibility. So keep your phone organized. Again, if you can do all of this from your phone, that's amazing. It's really not a big deal. You can even log or update your online members account through your phone. So, uh, you know, it's really not that hard to do. You've got to take the extra time to uh, take that 10 minutes a day to just make sure everything's updated constantly. And again, it will keep you accountable. You're going to be in the zone all the time. This is what your goal is. This is what you have to do. And if you're in the zone and you're goal oriented every day of the week, you're going to move towards your goal. If you're getting distracted by other things, you're going to move away from your goal. So stay focused and you should be fine. Finally, four new habits. I kind of just basically went over that right now. Um, there's all these things you have to do. In order to change your body, you have to change the way you live, your lifestyle, what you do on a day-to-day -day basis. You can't expect your body to change. You're going to get a shredded six-pack or a flat stomach and a great physique if you're doing the same crap you've always done day after day, year after year. So make that change, all right? Make the commitment. Understand this is what you want and take advantage of me because God damn it, I'm a damn good coach, okay? And I will get you where you want to go. You just have to take the time and effort to follow the system the same way that I'm taking the time and effort to make sure that you're following it. It's an interchange and it's an exchange of, of energies between us and together we can definitely get the results we want. That's pretty much it.